All righty. Wow. What a great morning. Maayo ka ayo, right? Nakai buhi, buhi padre. Is there life inside of you? Amen. See, when we worship God, something inside of you, buhi comes alive, right? Amen. When when he say, "Bubuhi ako, empty me, pour me out, Lord." Sa kanan, sa ako imo. So all I am is yours. When you worship, mag maghatag si mung kasing kasing sa tanan. Dili ukay ukay, dili mix mix, dili half and half like me. Okay, sa tanan. Sa Ginoo, yung promise is that He's gonna give you sa tanan. Grabe, na regalo sa Ginoo karon that is will blow your mind. So today, mag continue ta. Ato ang series on ang life by the Spirit. A Spirit-filled life. Ang kinabuhi na puno sa Espiritu. Sa balaan Espiritu. A life filled with the Spirit of God. Amen? So, um, we're gonna continue this. And then, gusto ko sa sunod after, give an opportunity to experience the Spirit of God. Amen? Kinsa dili mo gusto mo experience sa Espiritu sa ginoo, Right? Amen. Because na ay regalo karon, na ay promise from our Amahan sa langit that you can take. You know, karon it's Christmas time. Ah, sa akong regalo. Right? Where's my gift? There's the greatest gift karon that God is giving sa moi. Amen. And I'm excited to share what that is because it's not about ang mga tao. It's about sa ginoo. Say nga nat sa Hesus Kristo o sa balaan ni Espiritu, the Holy Spirit. And there's a gift today. So our series will continue karon about ang baptismo sa Espiritu, the baptism of the Spirit. Powerful kayo, promise, because it comes from heaven. Salangit, okay? So karon, maybe mag-ask mo, how do you receive ang baptismo sa Espiritu? Right? Nagabautismo. Is that how you say it? Nagabautismo sa Espiritu, right? To be baptized in the Spirit. How do you receive? You know, it's simple ra ka ayu. You know what the, how you can receive? Pangutana na lang. Mag-ask mo. When you ask, God said, I will give you. But, karun adlaw, gusto ko mag-explain sa imo that Jesus Christo, na siyang message karun about being ready to receive ang regalo sa ginoo. So first of all, because of this series, na kay faith, right? Faith comes from hearing the word of God, right? In Romans 10:17, it says this. So faith comes from hearing. Ang pagtoo moabot pinaagi sa pagpaminaw. So pagpaminaw unsa? Unsa imong pagpaminaw karon? Unsa? Ang pulong sa Dios, right? Right? The Word of God. It's alive. Dili ang idea na lang. Dili na lang sa mga tao. It's from the Espiritu sa ginoo. Ang balaan sa Espiritu. So ang Word, iyang truth, will give you life. So listen. Na kay liso sa sulod nimo. There is a seed. If, if you believe in God, right? Na ay milagro, dire. There's a miracle inside. Gusto mo ang milagro sa mong kinabuhi karun? Do you want a miracle in your life today? God says there's a miracle waiting to be birthed inside your life. And it comes from the Spirit of God. So, karun, if na kay sakit sa imong ununa, bugat sa imong kasing kasing, na kay daghan problema, daghan worries, adlok ka sa karun, adlaw sa ugma, sa tanan tuig. Grabe, karun, God has a promise. Na ay siyang liso, na ay siyang milagro, there's a miracle waiting to be birthed. Say mong kasing kasing sa solud nimo inside of you. Grabe. Exciting ka yo, ako excited na ko dere. Okay? So, pangutana na lang sa imo ah. But akong atong ato ang problema sa mga tao dere. Our problem as people is that we don't believe. Magdoubt mo. Is Ginoo really dere? Is God really here na akong daghan problema? Grabe, maybe God's not here. But God is saying, you need only believe. Magtoo lang. Right, Henry? Do you believe in Jesus, Hen? Amen. Amen. So, iyang kinabuhi is different kayo, night of day. Before Jesus, after Jesus. Magtoo na lang. Pangutana na lang mo. You need to ask. So today, I'm going to give you an opportunity to receive 
this gift na ay liso. Grabe! There's a miracle. Ang milagro sa imo ang kasing-kasing sa sulod ni mo. Okay? You need to allow the seed to grow. You need only believe. But akong question sa imo akaron. Unsa imong gituhuan? What do you believe in today? What do you believe in? Unsa imong gituhuan? Are you believing in politics? Are you believing in imong kwarta? Are you believing in unsa imong system karun? Are you believing in the sun and the sea and the fish and the waters? Or are you believing sa ginoo? Because importante ka ayo. Kabalo mo asa imo ang belief. Where do you believe? What do you believe in? So karon na ay bagong imbitasyon sa ginoo. Na ay party. Na ay party sa ginoo. Na ay bagong invitation. There's a brand new invitation from God. Let me read this from Revelations 22:17. Are you with me? Okay ra akong English og Bisaya, okay ra kayo? Okay ra. Oh, grabe ako muna una gamay. Woo! Init kayo. Pas pas na lang. Okay. Revelations, Gipadayag 22, verse 17. Okay? Dere. The Spirit and the Bride say, Come. Miingon ang Espiritu Santo o ang babae na kaslunon, kaslunon, dali. Right? It says, Come. Let anyone who hears this say, Let anyone who hears this say, Come. Let anyone who is thirsty come. Let anyone who desires to drink freely from the water of life. Let me read this in Bisaya. O ang tanang na naminaw mo ingon usab nga dali. Si bisan kinsa nga giuhaw o gustong mo inum mo duol o madawat sa tubig nga naghatag o kinabuhi. Wala kinibayad. If you are hungry, nagutom mo. If you are thirsty, Karun, God says, "Come." Na invitation for what? What is the party about? What is the gift? Unsang regalo sa ginoo karun? Akong series right now is about life by the Spirit. Grabe, I'm excited because this is the secret for a life of power. Kinsa today wants a life of peace? Kinsa, raise mo kamot. Ate, walay lying. Gusto mong peace? Oh, grabe, exacto. Gusto mong joy? Kalipay, right? Exacto. Satanan. This is the secret key. Sa ginoo, but dili so secret because it's right here sa Biblia. Okay? Once you are saved, mag-experience mo sa spirito. Right? You experience. Once you are saved, sa dihang naluwas ka, you have the indwelling of the Holy Spirit. Ang espiritu na buhi sa sulod. So, when you profess to be a Christian, a follower of Jesus, naka experience sa, sa, sa balaan ni spirito. You have a, a Holy Spirit experience. Nagdwell siya sa sulod sa nimo, okay? Magtransform siya from napatay mo to life sa buhi, okay? Before, after Christ. Importante ka ayo, do you understand the difference? This is what it means to be born again. Now today, mag-explain sa ako sa imo ang baptismo sa espiritu, right? Magbautis you, oh, grabe, okay? In the Holy Spirit sa Espiritu Santo is to be immersed in the Spirit of God, like soaking in water. Palihog, um, hen or somebody, can I have a glass of water? Zik. Na akong explanation sa imo, uhaw na kukud, so, double-double na lang, okay? Sakabaso na lang, hen. Oh, oh. Salamat. Also, this guy, put. let me just come here. This is a faithful servant of God. <laughs> Oh, very, very guapo kai. Oh, right? So, and he is, but you have to speak to us because he's like akung anak, so careful na lang, right? So, thank you. <laughs> All right. So, thank you for your service. So, dere, unsa ni? A glass of? Tobig, water. Water na lang. Tobig, right? Ang baso sa tobig, right? So, gusto, uhaw na ko, what happens? Maginum ko, right? I will drink this because I'm thirsty. And this is actually true. Okay. Asa ang tubig na? Asa? Sa sulod, sa asa? Sa ako ah? Oh, dari na lang. Asa akong tubig, dari? Dari? Asa? Asa? Oh, sa sulod sa tiyan, right? Akong tubig sa sulod sa tiyan. So, when nag-save mo, 
The Spirit of God comes in sa sulod ni mo. So when we sing a song, pour me out so all I am is yours, you're saying, Espiritu Santo, palihog yung Spirit. Sa sulod sa ako, because we are the temple of the living God. Ang baptismo sa Espiritu is different kaayo. Okay? So pamina o palihog, different kaayo. Let me explain na lang. Because this is the secret to a life of super, 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 supernatural power. Secret, but dili so secret. Okay? So, naginom ko ng tubig dere. The baptism in the Spirit is different kayo. Unsa na dito? Sa dagat, right? Kita mong dagat dito, the sea. Right. So if you just look at the dagat, dili nakagbasa. Right? And so, if you want to experience the dagat, what do you have to do? Add to sa dagat o unsa. You just add to the tune, just look at it na lang. Add to asa. Sa tubig, asa. How do you do it? Maglakaw ka, magjump in ka. Sa tanan, sa imong lawas, or just imong toe na lang. Sa, sa tanan, or dili? If gusto mo mag-refreshment sa tubig, sa swimming pool, unsa na lang, imong, imong tiil na lang. Oh, grabe init na ko kayo dire. Oh, but bug na kayo ang pool. Oh, yeah, lami kayo. Akong tow na lang, tow na lang, tow na lang. In Christian life, that's what we think. Sayang, the Lord says baptize in the spirit. So, born again, the spirit dwells inside. To be baptized, jump in sa spirit, the living water sa Ginoo. Do you understand the difference? Very different. Lumbong sa tubig. Right? Sa espiritu, lumbong to jump. Yesterday, I was with Akung Anak. We were at the pool. First thing you do at the pool is you just go, Dilit like, hinahinay lang. No, dilit. Satanan, immersed. Nanuman. Because that makes the whole water. You come in to the rivers of living waters. Another, akong example, another example. Akong cellphone dere, ah? Oh? Na ay power, right? Asa na kung butang sa power? Where does the power come from? Sa kurinte. Ang battery, right? Ang kung phone, oh, powerful kayo. Photos, surfing, pictures, videos, note taking. Grabe, it's powerful kayo. But walay battery, unsa? Sa young, it's just a brick. It's dead. Much the same, without the spirit dwelling sa imua, sa sulod ni mo, Listen, kaayu, which is kapoy kaayu, right? Do you understand? In the Bible, it says to be filled, mapuno sa espiritu. So now I'm gonna jump to this. Now I promise from the Father is available today. Ang saad gikan sa amahan. Na anakarun. Ang saad kinsa ni mo gusto ng saad. Ang promise like this. Unsa ni? Unsa ni? Akong sing sing. Unsa unsa akong promise dere? Wedding ring. Akong promise is for akong asawa. Na I promise. Og shit promise na siya sa ako. Yes. Kalipay ko kayo. Sigurado, right? Na I wedding promise. Oh, sa like akong anak. Og yung asawa sunod bulan. That's Joey. Na siyang wedding next month. Na siyang promises sa iya. So ang promise is exciting kayo. Karunad law ang saad gikan sa amahan. There is a promise from amahan sa langit. Okay? Na na karun. Dili ugma. Karun. It's available today. Kinsa dere gusto nag promise sa Ginoo? Kinsa dere? Do you want the promises of God? This is the secret sauce to a life with power. Even when imong life is lisud, there is a way to walk in the spirit of God. Jump into the rivers of living waters. Flood sa imong kasing-kasing, imong huna-huna sa tanan. Na ay demand from Jesus. Acts 1. Palihog, mag-open sa imong Biblia dito. Na kay Biblia. Dili. I'll just read it. Dili. Jesus commands us to wait for the promise of the Father. Okay? Gisugo kita ni Jesus. Do you hear that? Not wait. For unsa? Saan? Saad gikan sa amahan. 
That's what he says in Acts chapter 1 verse 4. And being assembled together with them, he commanded them. Nagsugo siya. Unsa nagsugo? Command. Right? Direction. If na kay military, if imong captain says, Uy, dili, uy. Okay, yes sir. Diretso na lang. Oh, lakaw de. Okay, yes sir. Nag-command, right? Nagsugo. Si Heso Cristo, nag-command. Unsa iyang command? It's nindot kayo. Iyang command is nindot. He says, just wait na lang. For the promises of God, not to depart from Jerusalem, but to wait for the promise of the Father, which He said, you have heard from me. Rabbi! 1 verse 5, John baptized with water, but in just a few days, you will be baptized with the Holy Spirit. Ang Espiritu Santo. God promised that He would pour out His Spirit upon all fresh. Nagsaad ang Dios. Na ibuhi niya ang iyang espiritu sa tanang tao. God promised that He was gonna pour iyang espiritu sa tanang tao. So kinsa dere is exempted? Any tao dere exempted from the Spirit of God? Wala. He says sa tanan tao all. Imong background if your Spanish background okay ra kaayo. If na kay Korean okay ra kaayo. If na kay double win you okay ra kaayo. If not kay German, okay ra kayo. It doesn't matter in mong background. God says, Satanan tao. This promise is for you and for me. Exciting kayo. This is the gift. He said, promise seed, right? This is the gift of the Holy Spirit. Kini mao ang regalo sa balaang Espiritu. Kini. This is the gift. So, karun. If you say you're a Christian, sometimes, some days, grabe lisod ka ayo, right? O na akong cycles, Pastor Wood, oh, na akong problema dere, balik na ko, akong sinning dere, oh, sayang, dili na ko gusto, but still I do it. Nanu man, lisod ka ayo. Because we're not walking with the power ang gahom sa Espiritu. The Spirit of God will give you the power that transforms sa sulod from the inside out. So when Jesus says, stay until you receive the power, grabe, of the promise of God, right? Magpabilin hangtod, madawat ni mo ang unsa? Saad. Right? The promise. Ang invitasyon sa ginoo. He's inviting us to receive. Right? Naakay biraglo. You have a miracle inside of you waiting to come alive if you would receive and believe so let's jump karun because i want to give you space to experience because tomo mag experience us baptism in the holy spirit amen because i'm telling you if you learn this one thing imong kinabuhi will be different forever i promise you that actually i don't promise you god promises you that but na kung experience Na akong testimony. You see, because magpractice ko sa spirito. Na when I have a problem sa akong huna huna, grabe, the spirit gives me peace. Okay, listen to this. How can you tell you are being baptized? Acts two, verse four, palihok. If you can open that with me, if you have your Bible. And they were all filled with the Holy Spirit and began to speak with other tongues as the Spirit gave them oper uh, um, utterance. They were all. Dili just gamay lang, maybe mga pugi na lang. The ones that are just good looking. The nice ones. Mga buutan na lang. Oh, they're the ones that receive the Dili. If you ask and you believe, you receive. It's not hard. It's a gift. Mag-explain ko a uh, few days ago to... Uh, Gary, humawan. I said, imagine this na lang. Nakai regalo from a very dato friend. And he gives you a Toyota Land Cruiser, 4x4, all power, all options, four wheel drive, monster truck. Dako kayo, mag ride ka sa mga bukid, walay problema. Mag park na lang sa imoa. You park it in imong balay. And then you sit there going, oh, I wish I could drive sa bukid. Oh, so lisod ka ayo, maglakaw na lang ko, oh, kapoy ka ayo. Oh, I wish na akong sakinan that could go sa bukid. 
Imong amigo has given you this gift that's everything you need. Na regalo ang promise sitting there sa imong balay. But dili nakagsulod, you don't go in. It's like the Holy Spirit is saying, I have a promise for you. You must receive, be baptized in the Spirit so you could walk in power. So you could walk with peace. So you could walk with joy. Listen to this. I'll try to read this in Pisaya. Act, uh, Binuhatan 2 verse 4. Napuno silang tanan sa Espiritu Santo. O diha-diha, gipasulti sila sa Espiritu Santo sa nagkaalain laing Mga pinulungan na wala nila matun-i. Does that make sense? I hope so. You might listen. A little tongue twisting. Some of those words. Whew. They began to speak with other tongues, right? That's called a heavenly language. Dili na ko gusto to go deep, lalong kaayo karon, but it's a gift from Ginoo to speak in tongues. It's a heavenly language that connects from the balaan espiritu. When he utters na lang sa isulod ni mo, and you speak. So we're made of spirit, mind, and body, right? Amen? Na kay soul, mind, o spirit. So kinsang matay karon? Akong Akong lawas? Pila katuig? Potential 100 years, I hope. Okay? And then, umana. Okay? Akong espirito, namatay siya? Dili. Walay katapusan. My spirit is eternal. So, akong unahuna tries to understand what the spirit speaks sa sulod. Dili ko kabalo. Grabe, akong spirit is doing something. Unsa, 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 unsa. Maghuri ko. Gusto ko magcontrol sa akong spirit man. But God says, let the spirit dwell sa sulod ni mo. And let it come out. So, unsa yang uh, example when they were baptized, they spoke in tongues as the spirit gave them utterance. Nagsulti sila. This gift, if I give you a gift, how can you receive? If I said, I want to give you this phone, right? Yani, come up here. Yani, gusto ko maghatag sa akong cellphone sa imuha. I want to give you my phone. What do you have to do to receive it? Do you have to do 10 press ups? No. No? Do you have to do like jumping jacks? Dili. Naghatag na lang ko sa imuha. And then, unsa? Mag receive mo. And then you use it. Bye bye. God bless you. Right? Now, if that's the case, so often, mag doubt mo. God says, Gusto ko, mag hatag si mo akong spirit. You must be baptized. You need to believe. Mangutangan na lang. Just ask and then receive. Simple rakayo. Just like akong anak. If they ask for something, I want to give it to them. Right? Maayong amahan. But we have our amahan sa langit. Maayo, maayo, maayo ra kaayo. Right? Perfecto siya. Gusto siya maghatag sa mo ayang espiritu. Ayaw pagka passive. So in imong spirit life, you can be passive kaayo. Okay. Okay, Pastor Wood, you said that I could receive the baptism of the spirit. Magwait na lang ko. I'm just waiting for whatever, shaking and rocking. Dili. If you receive the gift, you believe you got the gift. Right? Simple kaayo. God says, will you believe this gift? Dili ka mawadaan sa control. You won't lose control when the Spirit of God comes to you. Because na kay hadlok sa mga churches, sa mga tao, Oh, grabe yung scary kayo, ang spirit, right? Dili. It's a partnership. The spirit dwells within. The spirit maglakaw sa imuha. will walk with you. Dili nakag-lose control. So ako, na akong gift of tongues. So mag-practice ko kada adlaw. But na akong control. Dili na akong uncontrollable. Kabalo? Right? So karun, if I gusto ko mag-speak in tongues, kura basa dari, yeshe tiri, araba basa kadariya. I'm speaking in tongues. Dili na kong take over. Wala. It's a gift. But guess what? This gift is the Spirit of God sa sulod ni mo. Perfecto yung ampo. So karun, sometimes, imong ampo, you think, oh, lisod ka ayaw akong ampo. Dili na kong kabalo. Unsan na kong sulti sa ginoo. Correct? 
Gusto mo ang perfect prayers? Do you want perfect prayers? Let the Spirit of God pray in and utter through you. This is what happened today. They spoke. Perfect connection, the perfect language to heaven. Grabe! So if the Spirit is in you, magbaptize mo in the Spirit to receive it, you just ask. Pangutang na nalang. O believe. And the Spirit will come. But ayaw magbi passive. Don't be passive. Believe and use it. Like imong exercise routine. Mag start mo sa downstairs. Unsa nag downstairs te? Na kaya zumba zumba, right? Oh, lang zumba. Oh, kadaad lao. The first week, kadaad lao na lang. Duak oras kadaad lao every day. Ooh, ooh, ooh. And then the second, second week, uh, maybe, maybe every other ad lao na lang. Maybe isa ka oras na lang. Ina ina lang. Ina ina lang. And then eventual, wala na. So imong muscles, oh, dako kayo, dako kayo. And then gamay, 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 gamay. Oh, dako kayo, dako kayo. Gamay, gamay, gamay. Just up and down and up and down. Right? So when you're walking like that, sa young, God says He wants to lead you. If you just use imong huna huna to pray, the Spirit is not able to build imong life, imong kinabuhi. So, example, Ako na lang, personal. If na akong worries, na look ko sa future, maybe I've lost money or dilit na akong sure about akong family uh, situation or whatever it is, maybe wala na akong kwarta, mag-worry ko, right? Regular. You know what I do? I ask the spirit. Akong spirit man is faster than akong mental man, akong huna-huna. Okay? So, nag-trust ko sa akong spirit. So, when akong doubt comes sa akong una-una, I pray in tongues. I could just pray quietly na lang. What's Pastor Wood doing? It's okay, he's praying. Nag-connect ko sa spirito sa ginoo. And then, guess what? Mag-connect ko sa akong spirit, akong una-una, kalma na. Right? Ang stress ka ron is the biggest killer sa mga tao. Stress, right? Sa young, we have a young friend. Namatay siya, si Charlie. Right hand? Pila yung edad? 27? 30 na siya, so he's a little older than you. 30 anos na lang, seemed healthy kaayo. Alasay is yesterday, right? Sleeping na lang siya, na siyang heart at cardiac. You see, you don't know what Ugma brings, but you know that today, now I promise from Gino saying, I want to give this to you. The question is, will you receive it so that you can live a life of peace? You can live a life of joy. Kalipay ka ayo. So, kinsa dere, gusto mo mag baptismo sa spirito. Kinsa dere, do you want to receive this gift? I want to ask you this question. Because, Karun, what I want to do is I'm going to put some music on so dili naka. Ulaw kayo, right? And I want you to hear what the Spirit is calling for you. Karun, if you are not sure who Jesus is, if wala nakaghatag imong kasing kasing sa Heso Kristo, Satanan, maybe imong understanding karon is just ang religion. Religious na lang, dili ang relasyon. I want to give you an opportunity, karon, an opportunity. So the Spirit magdwell sa sulod nimo, right? And then you can be baptized at the same time. Amen? So if excited mo maghatag sa imong kasing kasing, like, real kaayo. Dili just an idea or because na kay pressure sa imong mga igso undere. Dili na ko gusto ang pressure sa imo. Akong relasyon sa gino is real kaayo. The real deal. That's why you can come as you are to God. So if gusto mo, maghatag imong kasing-kasing, if you want to give your heart to Jesus, karun, I want to give you an opportunity. First time, okay? Those that are watching online, put if you've never given your heart to Jesus, use this chance right now to give your heart and say, God, I give you satanan. Not just part-time na lang, partial, but satanan, because I trust say more. And then I'm going to give you an opportunity to be baptized in the Spirit. Okay, ra? Deal?
It's simple. You don't have to do anything special. You need only unsa believe. You need only believe. Kinahanglan lamang motoo. You need only believe that Jesus died for you to take your sin away on that cross, and He's made a way for you to have ang relasyon balik sa imong amahan sa langit, to put you back in relationship with God, not religion. But relationship. Importante kayo that you understand that. Okay? Amen? Amen. So, in a moment, let me just find something here. I want to play this. Hopefully, it'll play through. Am I still on? Okay, so Karun, maybe close him on eyes so that nobody feels nervous kaya you. Just between ikaw o ginoo. It's just between you and God. Alright? So if gusto mo maghatag imong kasing-kasing Karun sa ginoo, if you want to give your heart afresh to Jesus, this is your chance, okay? So with all of your eyes closed, palihog. And if you want to give imong heart to God afresh today, you can do this online and right here. I want you to raise him and come up because we're going to pray. Will I had look? No fear. Mangate, whether you're old or young, if you want to give your heart to Jesus today afresh, now is the chance. Don't wait for Ogma because Ogma is daily promised. Right? If Imon Kazin Kazin is beating and you're like, oh, maybe I should give my heart afresh, Karun. If your heart is beating, saying, man, I don't know Jesus the way Pastor Wood is talking about. Today is the day of your salvation. If you want to give your heart to Jesus, just raise your hand. Well, I had to look. Raise your hand. Amen. Thank you, Ate. Thank you. Raise your hand. Well, I had to look. Just close your eyes. Raise him and come out and say, God, thank you, Ate. I want to give. Thank you, Ate. Today, I want it to be ang relasyon, dili ang religion. I don't want a religious relationship. I want a real relationship. Amen. Thank you, Ate. Thank you, Ate. God is here today, guys. And He wants to share. Maghatag iyang gugma sa imuha. So let's pray this together. Amahan sa langit. I give you my heart. I receive your gift of life. Thank you. Thank you. Salamat ginoo. For dying on the cross, Sakwa. For me. To take my sins away. So that I, Karunadlao, today can have a relationship with you. I choose you. I ask you. Balaan sa Spirito. Holy Spirit, come and dwell in me. Sa sulod sa ako. Thank you, Lord. Karunad Lao is a new day and a new life. Magdedicate ko sa tanan lawas huna-huna Oga kong spirito, oga kong kasing kasing, my whole mind, my body, my mind and spirit to you. Come, Lord Jesus. I am yours and you are mine. Thank you that I am saved today. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Amen. Well done. If you prayed that prayer, don't go away without speaking to somebody because we want to help you with the bagong relasyon sa ginoo. Na ay tools. It's exciting. I promise you, when you walk with God, you will be different forever. Amen? Imong prayer life will be different. Imong daily life will be different. Where you struggled before will be different. But now, for those that have never been baptized in the Holy Spirit, I want to give you a chance. 
It says in the Biblia that we should be baptized, we should be filled kada adlaw. But if you've never asked to receive this gift of the baptism of the Holy Spirit, I want you to pray with me right now. So this karon kinsa dere gusto nimo magbaptismo sa espiritu. Kinsa. Amen. Amen. Thank you. Amen. Thank you. Amen. Well, I had looked at it because this is the power of the Holy Ghost. Amen. Amen. So wherever you're at, maybe stand up. Tindog na lang. Tindog na lang. Because this is the baptism of the Spirit. So kinsa pa dere gusto ni mo magbaptismo sa Espiritu. Well, I had looked. If you want to be baptized, tindog na lang. Say, God, I receive today, okay? I want to give you another chance. Anybody else want to be filled with the Spirit, to be baptized? Proud of you boys. Proud of you boys. Well done. Because when you hunger to be filled with the Spirit of God, He's going to bring new life. You will be different. God says, I've come to bring life. I will pour out a Holy Spirit. And when you receive, woo, you'll never be the same again. Amen? So, one last call. Kinsa pa din eh, gusto ni mo magbaptismo sa Espiritu. Amen. Stand up, Mike. Tindog na lang. Gusto mo the power of the promise sa ginoo. Pray with me. Lord, salamat sa imong saad. Thank you for your promise. That you will baptize me with your Holy Spirit and with power. Na imo kang bungyagan sa imong Espiritu Santo o sa imong gahong. Right now I ask, karon akong ginahangyo that you would baptize me in the Holy Spirit. Nga imo kang bunyagan sa Espiritu Santo. And I receive this gift. Ug ako makadawat kini nangasa. Amen. Amen. That's all it takes to receive. So now, don't rush off. Because if you receive and you believe, you've received the baptism of the Spirit. So in a moment, we're going to practice. Okay, right? Because you, when you receive, young men, when you receive, say, God, I receive. Now we need to step out and cooperate with the Spirit. Karun, lakang sa lakang o kooperasyon sa Espiritu Santo. We need to step in faith. Don't wait. Don't wait. Karun makadawat sa ngalan ni Jesus. Karun makadawat sa ngalan ni Jesus. Karun makadawat sa ngalan ni Jesus. Now receive in the name of Jesus. So right now I'm going to pray. And if na kay tongue or if you have an experience in your heart in the baptism of the Spirit, let it come out. Even if it's ang gamay words na lang. Even if it's isaka syllable na lang, like la, 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 blah, blah, blah. Whatever it is, it doesn't matter. Believe that you've received and this power will fall upon you. Amen? Amen. So I'm going to count to three and I want you to pray with me. One, two, three. Sa ngalan ni Jesus, I receive. Don't be afraid. Speak whatever tongue that God has given you. Just like in the book of Acts, they received. Do not fear. While I had look, don't let your mind get in the way. Thank you, Jesus. Start to thank Him. Say, Salamat ginoo karun na akong Spiritu Santo. I've been baptized in the Spirit. You need to step out. Pagsugod karun. Ayaw paghulat. 
Don't let your mind, Imam Huna Huna, get in the way. Young men, if you've really received, allow the Spirit to utter from deep within inside of you. If you want the perfect prayer, perfecto imong ampo sa ginoo, sa ginoo I receive. Karunad lao, ko rabasa tarayye tiriya rababa shandaradi. Oh rababa satarayye kentiriya rababa. Let your glory fall in this place. Holy Spirit, I thank you that you are the God of overflow. Rivers of living waters come right now, Lord God. I thank you, Father. When we ask, we receive. Open open your mouth. Because if you stop it, Sayang, if you stop it, Sayang, that power, the same power that raised Jesus Christ from the dead is available, say Moa. Say young, if you let fear cut you off, speak in the gift of tongues. If God has given you the faith to speak in tongues, speak it out. For you that have the gift of tongues, start to speak it out now. Start to speak it out now. Encourage your brothers and sisters to walk in the Spirit. What I'd like you to do in a moment is for the leaders of the church, Maybe if you guys could get up, Mars, Pastor Gary, Pastor Alid, Ati Rose, all of you guys, come and start to pray for these brothers and sisters. Is that okay? Let's believe. I don't want you to stop. Don't stop, Karun. I hear fear. Well, I had look. Say, God, I receive. God, I receive. You know your illustration that you did with your name with the giving the phone. There's actually a sense of receiving. I think sometimes it's really helpful for people to almost just close their eyes and lift their hands. Just almost as a sense of like, God, I'm ready to receive. Mm. Keep their like hands ready. No, in a sense of just like, if you want to receive a gift, what do you do? You need to receive Open it. your hands, yeah. And it's almost like, there's nothing special about opening your hands. No. But what you're doing is saying, God, I'm here ready to I'm receive. I'm open. Okay, I love it. Yeah. Okay, I love it. That's great, guys. So Karun, just as an expression, Karun say mung kasing kasing. You know, like naghatag sa akong cellphone si Yani. Unsa yung kamot magopen siya. So nay, open your hands. If gusto mo magreceive the power from heaven, just be in a place like this. It's not about being super spiritual, but you're just saying, Sa ginoo, mag-receive ko sa mo akarun. I receive your spirit, your gift, the promise. I receive in the name of Jesus. Amen? Allow God to minister to your heart. Spirit of the living God, fill akong nanay right now. Let your power in home flow through her body. I speak to her mind right now, Lord God, and I say, listen to the spirit that is alive in Nanai. I thank you, Lord, that these guys are ready to receive. I pray, Lord, as she opens her hands, let your power fall right now, Lord God. Let there be a revelation. Receive the baptism of the Holy Spirit. Receive the gift that comes from God. Right now in the name of Jesus. Use your tongue. Well, I had looked at it. Open him, Baba. I know it feels weird to start with, but trust and believe. When you believe, you will be transformed from the inside out. Release right now, Lord God. Baptize them in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit right now, Lord. I thank you for the gift of salvation, the gift of life, and receive the fullness of the gift from the Father in heaven. Right now, release. Right now, in Jesus' name, Zangala ni Jesus, Mbalaan sa Spirit. Right now, Lord God, receive in Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Kura daraba ketiri araba. Kura daraba kalara sandara yetiri araba. 
Receive right now in the name of Jesus. I ask, Lord, Lord God, that they open their hands. Mag receive, Lord God, sa imong espiritu. Ang imong balaan espiritu. Karun adla, Lord. Kura ba da da ye bendiri araba. Sobra na ni kita da ya ba. Moya se jere araba ba. Ashanda araba. Let the Spirit of God rise up. In Jesus' mighty name. Kura da da ye kindiri araba. Oh Jesus, right now, Lord, for my dear sisters here, receive the baptism of the Holy Spirit right now. I thank you, Lord, that they are receiving the fullness of heaven right now. For my boys here, Lord God, in the name of Jesus, I thank you for faith. I thank you, Lord, for the seeds of faith released right now. Open your heart. Open your mouth in the name of Jesus right now. Let the fire of God fall. Let there be a release in the name of Jesus. Let the fire of the Holy Ghost and balance and spirit to fill them. I thank you, Lord, that they are not walking in might or in their mind, but by the spirit of the living God. They will walk as men that carry the fire of the living God, release right now. Let it out from the very inner being. Speak that out. Speak that. Believe. Do not doubt. Speak it. Use that gift of tongues. You have received. You have received. Let it go. Let it flow. You have received in the inner being, Henry. You are receiving the blessing of the Spirit of God. Speak with the gift of tongues. This is a new day, Henry. This is a new day. Let that mouth open. Release that mouth in the name of Jesus. Release these jaws to speak life, to utter the very Spirit of the living God right now. In the name of Jesus. Right now, in Jesus' name, keep speaking. Keep speaking. Do not stop. Keep speaking. You've received it, Zik. Now release, Zik. Let that mind come into alignment with the Spirit right now. Speak out in faith, Zik. If you believe that you receive, Zik, you have the gift from the Spirit of God. You're baptized. Now speak in faith, Zik. Receive it, Zik. Even if it's one or two words, Zik, speak it out, Zik. Do not fear, Ezekiel. Do not fear, Ezekiel. God has called you and set you apart. He wants to give you this gift so you will walk in power. Release in the name of Jesus. Release in the name of Jesus. Release in the name of Jesus. Oh, in the name of Jesus. Let it go, Kobe. Release it, Kobe. If you've received, speak it, Kobe. There is no fear in the presence of God, Kobe. Speak it out, Kobe. Open his jaws, Lord God. I say to his mind, be in alignment with his spirit right now. That they Thank you, Lord, that you've called him for such a time as this. Speak, Kobe. Speak it out. Do not fear. When you open your mouth, you need to step forward in the name of Jesus. You've received it. Now go. Now run, Kobe. Do not wait in Jesus' name. Do not stop. If you want the Spirit to be alive, connect. Connect with the living God. There's a story when the, when the priest took the Ark of the Covenant, Covenant and presence sa Ginoo and they crossed the Jordan River. You know what they had to do? They had to step in the waters first, primero. Take a step right now. Don't stop. Don't stop. In Jesus' name, release the fullness of heaven right now. Heavenly Father. Release your tongue in Jesus' name. I thank you, Lord. It's not by might nor by power, but by your spirit. Spirit of the living God, release right now in Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' mighty name. Receive in the name of Jesus. Receive in the name of Jesus. You have a life. This is a life by the Spirit of God. It's a relationship. Powerful, very different. 
I promise you will never be the same when you receive this gift. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. If not, guys, song that starts to bubble up in your heart, let's spend time so presence is you know, let it bubble up. Sing a song from the Spirit of the Living God. Holy, 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 holy. Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. Open your mouth, do not stop. Ezekiel, do not stop. Open your mouth, Kobe, do not stop. Use this gift, step into the rivers of living waters. Do not stop. How thirsty are you? How hungry are you for the Spirit of God? How hungry are you to receive the presence of the living God? If you have a song bubbling up in the Mung Spirit, let it out. Open your mouth. Let the Holy Spirit utter from within you. Let Him speak from deep. Napuno sila tanan sa Espiritu Santo. Og diha diha gipasulti sila sa Espiritu Santo. Nagkakalain laing mga pinulungan nga wala nila matun-i. Let it out. Let it flow. Let the Spirit of God flow in your heart today. Remember, you are in control. You work in partnership with the Spirit of God, Micah. In the name of Jesus, release this gift. Baptism in the Spirit of God. Open your tongue, Micah. In Jesus' mighty name. Speak, Micah, in faith. Believe and receive in the name of Jesus, son. Let it come from your inner being, Micah. Believe that God is speaking through your spirit, God. Holy, holy. Holy, holy, holy. 